Now, I want you to understand that if, if your father, your grandfather had entered into an evil covenant, if you decide to break out of it, you have to stand strong and firm. If not, the powers that have been, that, that, that has been partnered with, they will come against you. They will make life miserable for you. And so when you decide not to worship the gods of your father, when you decide not to go the way of your father or your mother, then you have to stand strong. Remember the Bible said, if you are not hot nor cold, I will spit you out. So you have to stand strong. Now, when it comes with the devil, you cannot play carrot and sticks with him. He is very wise. Remember, he has been in this game for ages. And so even man met him on earth. And so you cannot outsmart him. So you have to make a decision to stand with God and stand strong. The Bible says, if the foundation be weak, what can the righteous do? We're going to pray. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, I invoke the blood of Jesus upon the foundation of my life. The Bible says, if the foundation be weak, what can the righteous do? Father, today, in the name of Jesus, I invoke the blood upon the foundation of my life, the foundation of my family. I invoke the blood, the blood of Jesus. The Bible says the blood of Jesus speaking better things than the blood of Abel. Today, in the mighty name of Jesus, I invoke the blood of Jesus upon the foundation of my life, the foundation of my family. In the mighty name of Jesus, I invoke the blood, the blood, the blood, the blood that speaking better things. The Bible says that you overcame by the word of their testimony and by the blood, the blood of Jesus. Lord Jesus, Jesus, every evil covenant of my father's house, every evil covenant of the family I'm married into, today in the name of Jesus, I invoke the blood upon the foundation of my father's house, upon the foundation of my in-law's house, I invoke the blood, the blood of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ.